A new explanation for the repeating nested helical paths of motion from the smallest particles of existence, photons, to moons, planets, stars, galaxies, etc. Given that each moon orbits around its planet, and each planet orbits around its central sun, The combination of orbits 1 and 2 creates a helical pathway for a moon. If a star's orbit around its central galactic black hole, which is a closed curve path, is added to the moon's path, the final path will be a combination of paths 1, 2, and 3, and the path of moon will be a nested helical orbit. But by adding the new galactic motion, orbit number 4, to these three orbits, another helical orbit is added to them and in fact, three helical orbits will be created in the form of nested orbits as a result of the effect of these four orbits. In general, if we have n paths, we have to imagine n minus 1 nested helical orbits for that particular mass, moon, planet, star, etc. Notes 1. The paths of celestial objects could be observed in different models. First model. If the observer looks at these helical orbits from the side, the motion of the celestial objects appears as a repeated close sinusoidal motion. Second model, but if the observer looks at the orbit from inside the rings, the image of a closed ring will be seen, like the images of celestial object taken by the James Webb Space Telescope.
third model, if the observer looks at the helical orbit in a vertical direction from the top or the bottom, the image will be repeating nested helix in a closed curve. First model, the model is a combination of all these that depending on the observer's position will see different modes. Two, depending on whether the helical orbit is clockwise or counterclockwise, in general terms, it can be said that 95% of the motion of celestial objects in the universe is clockwise. If the direction of motion is clockwise from the observer's perspective, it means that it is moving away from the observer, and if the direction of motion is counterclockwise from the observer's perspective, it means that the moving object is approaching the observer. Therefore, all moving objects in the universe, from the smallest particles such as photons to the largest, like galaxies and clusters, have a nested helical motion. Result To show the nested helical motion path for a galaxy, which is a closed curve path with a twist, the image of the Lanyakiyab supercluster is a perfect and clear example.